All right, language explorers. So let's have a look at today's word of the day. So flask, fl ask. Yeah, flask. Let's try and get a picture. Maybe flask. Okay, maybe not. A beacon, maybe. Okay, chemistry. Ah, yeah, yeah. Here we are. Flask like that. Uh huh. Yeah, flask. Yeah. Uh, yeah, okay, flask, yeah. So, a metal, not always metal, could be, um, well, generally metal, actually. A metal container, container that you put liquids into, whether to store or drink. Flask, to screw it, maybe to drink from. So, I have a flask. I, I need... I need a flask when traveling. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they brought with them enough flasks for the water. He only uses a metal flask. I think, well, no, she thinks, she thinks that this flask is better than that one, than that one. This flask is better than this one. Yeah. I, they, he, she, it. It is the flask that I normally use. It's the flask I normally use. Because I, because, because I like the shape and feel of it. The shape and feel, the way it feels, yeah, how cool is that? They don't have enough flasks, they need, they need more flasks for the tourists, more flasks, how cool is that, yeah. She wanted a metal flask, now why, why don't they use plastic flasks instead. Why not? I'm not sure. I'm buying a flask. Oh, flask. S K for the journey. So, well, I'll, I'll, I'll need to bring a big enough flask with me because you never know when the water might be useful. Yeah. How cool is that, language explorers? Yeah. We might need another flask with us. So, by having another flask, we can store, and, and well, we can collect and store more water. How cool is that, language explorers? Yeah. How cool is that? So, flask, a container that you put liquids into, whether to store or to drink. Yeah, and metal, not always, but generally, yeah. Yeah, but how cool is that, language explorers? So, can you use flask in a sentence? Can you write it in the comments below? And like the video, subscribe to the channel, more videos to come, more lessons to come. And you can find me by searching English with Adrian on YouTube, Facebook, and Telegram as well as by searching Adrian Nanchev on Udemy. Yeah, how cool is that, language explorers? Let's keep exploring.